Who can mail in my shoes? You ain't throwing as much shots as I do. You don't throw on the Glock like I do. You definitely throwing that plot like I do. Lately, I've been feeling alone. Everybody close to him get hit. I'm talking pop with the sub. This shit look better than Ginobili off the bench. Nah, his face is... Just because you think you fight good, you think you good with a punch? Nigga, you barely fit in the hoods that you wear. What makes you think you fit in the hood that you're from? Listen. Oh, 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 oh. It's okay. Man, man, salute to the subscribers, that notification gang, etc, etc. Don't let none of that get too far ahead of you. You know who I be. Shout out to my brother Showtime SP and all the subscribers that rock with this content, whether religiously or in passing, etc, etc. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So today, you know what I'm saying, it's a dope Wednesday. Uh, it's a little brisk outside, cool, you know what I'm saying. I've been chilling. I got to watch a battle. Like, first of all, I love when people watch battles and, you know, will throw me ideas or throw me battles that they want me to see or want me to talk about. They gotta be good though, you know what I'm saying? Sometimes niggas be throwing me battles from their homeboy like, yo, we need to recap this, I watch it, I be like, nah. Oh, hell no! That ain't happening. Who, who told you this or who sold you this? I can't buy this, my G's. Nah, I'm good, I'm not jacking it. Get that out of here. So, um, when the battles fired, two, two or three people had told me to watch Death the Kid versus JC, you know what I'm saying? I'm like, well, I hadn't seen JC in a while, you know what I'm saying? So I wanted to see what JC, every time, well, JC battle come along, I'ma watch it, you know what I'm saying? Like, it is what it is. It's like, it's like, you may not watch Sports Center or any sports show, the whole show, but if you happen to be walking by the TV and the top 10 highlights come on, you gonna definitely take a look at the top 10. Who don't look at, everybody watch the top 10. Everybody watch the top 10. Oh yeah, make sure you subscribe to our sports channel, Stop the Run. I'll make sure I pin it in the top comments, you know what I'm saying? Shout out to everybody over there too, and my bro Scrap. Um, so, you know, I'm thinking to myself, I gotta watch a JC battle, because it's happening, you know what I'm saying? So I watched the battle, and I watched, like, if, shout out to iBattle, Lex, everybody over there's doing what they're doing over there, iBattle, they even putting out a dope, Bunch of phenomenal battles, the Rock versus Feeble, you know, all the joints that we recap, Rum Nitty and Oppa, everything that's been going down over there for like the past couple years, they've been cooking, right? So why would I think anything different of this, right? So I'm watching, and uh, I'm watching Death the Kid's round, and it's a one rounder, right? And I remember seeing Death the Kid down there in um, Atlanta on Max Out, you know what I'm saying? That's dope for him to even make it to a Max Out this quickly in his career. He's on Max out, he's battling XL. I watched the battle, I had XL winning. He still, I feel like Def Kid is nice. He got fire lines, he can put together some dope ass bars. I do got bars over there, I'ma I'm I'm get to them in a second. So, I just feel like he gotta be more, his pr preparation, he gotta be sharp, you know what I'm saying? He had moments in his battles where he'll have slips or he'll have stumbles or he'll choke out at the end of a round. And my thing is this, when you come into the NBA, which is, I'm saying the NBA, I'm not saying no league of battle rap is the NBA, you know what I'm saying, I'm not with that. I'm saying when you make it to the big stages where everybody's talking to you, you're making it on these main cards, you was on Max Out. Max Out was the best event of 2013, 2023, I'm bugging. Um, Max Out was the best event of 2023, you was on it, and you probably was the only person that had a slip or a stumble in, in, on the whole card, my nigga. Just saying. <laughs> I'm just saying. But you do have, um, I watched your bars, I listened to them, I watched the battle twice. And I do like your trajectory and where you can go and the bars that you do have. I honestly think if they took all the best 20 bricks and Crucible and got a top 20, all these niggas put together and you was in there, I think that you would be towards the top five of that group. I do. I think you're that good, right? So I'll talk about the battle. I'll talk about, you know what I'm saying? So JC's in this battle. I'm like, man, what, what's up with JC, man? JC gonna be on this Killer Gorilla shit. You know what I'm saying? Is he, is he killer gorilla? Is he back in his bag? Is he is he doing everything that wanted us for him to get a surf battle? I know when he got it. I know when he got it. It wasn't solid. But everything that we that he did to get there, you know what I'm saying? Let's make it fair. Everything he did that wanted to get there, we, we, we was with that shit, right? You know what I'm saying? Oh yeah, make sure y'all share the video, man. Like I said, y'all share them hoes, y'all share blunts. Some of y'all niggas share clothes, share cars, share this motherfucking video, bitch. So shout out to all y'all. Um, so I wanted to see what JC was gonna be on. Um, so, you know, I had to, let's get to the bars, you know what I'm saying? Bars make the stars, you know what I mean? Def the Kid comes out. He said, I wasn't gonna talk about your height like I did on Twitter, but I seen lives cut shorter than you. I'm not here to make fun of your height like I did on Twitter, 
But I seen lives cut shorter than you. See? Oh, I like that joint. Had a Miles Morales on the web. I jumped through holes to get to this spot. Fire. I stay positive like electrons because I feed off negative energy. Then these pockets, like he started getting, because one thing I like, I like some things about him, like the flow is there and his ability to get to the punch that keeps you entertained is there. You know what I'm saying? Like he's like, he's a punch, but he's a writer. He's got like different, like, so peep this shit. He says, I kill so many people, I forget hitters. After I black out, I lose sight like moonlight, then pop up at the wake and see dead people. Woo -hoo -hoo -hoo. Alright. Yo, whose man is this? Yo, yo, show to SP. Where you yo SP? Get this nigga, man. This nigga right here. We gotta keep our eye. Yo. Fuck what you listen to what I'm saying, my nigga. We gotta keep our eye on this nigga right here. You know what I'm saying? The nigga said, I pop up at the wake and see dead people. You knew what that man. So he says, uh You the one went from getting smoked in an Al Capone shirts to blunt trauma. You know JC used to wear the nasty work. Al Capone sweater, the black joint with the white tee that was longer than the black tee, but it wasn't really a white tee. It was like, you know what I'm saying? Mm. Nigga. Like, like, like motherfucker Chess said, oh, talking about that past shit that's past tense, my nigga. I ain't gonna even do JC like that today. But he was he was one of the Al Capone warriors too. It was a bunch of niggas that was running around in that shit. He asked me to do it. I was like, absolutely not. So it, it is what it is. But some cats is making like a band to wear the ugly shirt. You gonna wear you know, other thousand dollars for the day. That's a good money with that ugly ass shirt. I don't know where that nigga's at now. But um, he says uh, he says surf he says surf with a body like they like all we saw was surf get a body like David Hasselhoff. I like that. He said this little nigga this little overrated nigga got no shot. Just handle Julian Newman. This dude ain't got no shot or handle. Just Julian Newman. That Julian Newman bar was fire. Y'all know Julian Newman. To push his limits and develop his skills through rigorous training. Hours in the gym, working on handles, Julian was hitting from NBA range before most were even taking the game serious. This early exposure to the short little mother, little dribble, 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 dribble shit. He's like 5'7. He got handled like hell. We said he got, <laughs> he said he got just shot, <laughs> no shot, just handled Julian du Newman. This dude is amusing. Then he said, when the slaughter ends, you're going to be left with a crooked eye, Joel Ortiz. I like that. Uh, run berserk with mercs. I'm a pessimist. So we're going to shoot down everything till you understand that nothing works. Ooh -wee. Yes, sir. Yo, this nigga, yo, this nigga, this nigga, he, he, he slick. Nice. Now, I like that part. The pessimist shoot down everything till nothing works. Oh, yeah, yeah. I like that shit. Man. I, I, I do. 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 Uh... He said, uh, he says, uh, to survive this, you're going to need incredible odds. You had a better chance of getting a federal. Now, getting a federal job is hard. He said, you had a better chance of getting a federal job. Now, you know, if any of y'all ever applied for a federal job, that's crazy. You got to upload mad documents. You got to do, bro, that part, crazy. So he says, uh, Funko Pop put him on kid shelf for acting big headed. I like that joint. Um, he says, uh. He said, you, you good with a punch? He said, you nigga, you barely fit in the hoods that you wear. What makes you think you fit in the hood that you from? Suave Mende! Yo! The nigga said, you... <laughs> he said, you barely fit in the hood that you wear. What makes you think you fit in the hood that you from? Yeah, I ain't gonna lie, I'm getting cooked. <laughs> <laughs> Same thing. <laughs> With all of that, that shit was kind of crying. Now, now, JC, I ain't gonna lie. At this point, let me tell you something, my nigga. JC, you know, I know you had that surf shit going on and all of that. But at this point in the battle, my nigga, I'm like, this nigga gonna fuck. He about to fuck around. I don't, don't want to say he got. I ain't want to put no spice on it like that. I wasn't not even about to put no spice on it. But I'm just gonna say shit was getting a little crazy for a second. So when it got to. About the six minute round in the round, you know what I'm saying? When he so blood spit for like six minutes, and when he was done with his round, he got a lot of reaction. I was like, Yo, kid, deaf kid. But I will say this you had a slight slip towards the end of your round. Explain something to you because you want to understand you had some main feats, you made a lane, but I'll get you. Come on, my nigga. <laughs> and then you ended your round like. You gave me a hard time, time. It was like you choked out. I ain't gonna lie. It, I, it was like you jerseyed out at the end of your round. It was only one round. It was six minutes. I'm sure that it was probably a five or whatever, but you just spit to a six. So I ain't gonna say you choked, but the way you ended was. 
you gotta, you gotta smooth that down. I'm just saying, you gotta smooth it out. Um, so JC comes into his round, and I'm like, what are we getting? So he starts off the round, he said, it's a difference in between being known as a nigga named Death and a nigga known for it. I said, okay, okay. He said, parallel universe, let's play. The irony, they got my date with death to be a death date. I said, oh shit, I said, yo, keep, keep, keep your eye on Al 5. This nigga might, he might steal the show. Hold. So he's like, he said, the, 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 your date with death. Then he says, the 40 kid back, like first class with the leg space. Ooh. Yeah. Yeah, 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 Ooh, yeah, 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 it was about to start getting dark for my boy. So he says, uh, for Mr. Miyagi, I can just show you my skills with the chopsticks on the, f on the, on the Vada. I can show you my chopsticks on the fly. He said, I can show you my chopsticks on the, I can show you. My skills with the chopsticks on the fly. Then there was another bar that I like personally, but it didn't really get no reaction. He said, Buck 50, it's going to be very clear when I raise the issue. You know what I'm saying? Like, Buck 50, he's going to be very clear. The razor issue. He said, when I raise the issue, I liked it. But anyway, he says, uh, then the next line after that was fire. You know, Pop with the sub. I'm talking Ginobili off the bench. <laughs> Crazy. Uh, now his face is burning. He can't be certain. Fate emerging. He dizzy. Can't tell if the whole room's spinning or just the table's turning. I'm oh. that. I'm that. Why you get my nigga like that, son? Well, yo, he said this nigga don't know if the room's spinning or if it's the t Yo, I'm like, yo, do they got, does this nigga got insurance? Do this nigga got insurance, son? Cause he's about to be going to malpractice. He gonna have a malpractice lawsuit. JC about to rough him up. All right, so he says after that, he says the table's turning. He says, you know how many times them little bumps done turned into a body? I'm Killmonger like that. The cans drew crossfire like the clan do. Ooh, 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 ooh. <sighs> so by this point in the round, I'm like, all right, man, let me go get a refund because even though I was, you know what I'm saying, I was deaf to kid it out, JC is, is, is not playing in his round. So he says, uh, uh, if you ever study tectonic plate shifting, you gonna understand when I land move. Oh my god. Oh. <laughs> and then the crowd, nigga, in the crowd, the crowd was fucking you up. The crowd, he gotta learn. These are your people. Is this your people? Is these your motherfucking people in here? Yo, nigga, why? It... The nerve of you. <laughs> but you That's know, like, disrespect. That's why you doing this? Like, come on, son. <laughs> I'm already got a rough time and you in here helping me chill out. So he says, uh, We've been stuffing heaters and whips longer than Domino's pizza. Then the nigga in the crowd, he's walking on water. Yes, sir. This nigga's spitting. Damn, nigga. He's walking on water. I'm like, bro, like, could you please, bro? I just asked you two seconds ago. Like, bro, bro, come on, man. Like, what's up with you? So he's walking on water now. I carry that 1911 like it's a piece of history. You butt in, you get the big text. I let the Drake respond. Uh, running Eps longer than Baby D. The crowd is starting to say, leave him alone. What's wrong with you? I wrote him down. Then JC says a fire line about Ramadan Muslim Quran that I didn't even ever think of. He says, Ramadan, if I'm Muslim, they going go then eh, Ramadan, if I'm Muslim, they going fast asleep. Ramadan, if I'm Muslim, they going fast to sleep. That shit was fire. Then he says, uh, I hit you and who you riding with. I shoot like compromised media. But why is this? I'm a post, I'm a only post bias shit. That was so fire. I'm a compromised media. I'm a only post bias shit. <laughs> JC floating, boy. That shit was fire. <laughs> uh, I'm a Mac 10 Packer like Jordan Love. Mac 10 Packer. Packers number 10 is Jordan Love. He's like seven, eight minutes into this round and he's still floating. Like, why does he, why, why, did you pay for this? Is this a hit? I feel like this is a hit job. Like, they don't like you over there, Def. They don't like you. 
They, this is a hit. This is a facilitated act against the RICO, man. This is a hit. This is a conspiracy right here. These niggas lined you up. They, I, I can't feel no other way about it. So he says, uh, you might need the staff to get you out like Exodus. And then the, JC does some shit I haven't seen in forever. Like literally ever in a battle. He gets himself booed. He got himself booed. Your round was average as the weed here. Be clear. Your round was about as average as the weed here. You know, the crowd starts booing because, you know, obviously they're going to feel disrespected. Uh, and JC ends the round floating, man. I'm thinking to myself, where was this versus Surf? Where was this versus Surf? I, this is the problem I be having. I know you ain't going to come here and walk on water versus uh, Death the Kid, but you ain't give you Sue Surf. You had that? I'm going to take it all into perspective, though. You know what I'm saying? You're probably going through a rough time then, you know what I'm saying? You know, everything that was going on in your life personally because ain't no way in hell you this nice versus him. That was the JC that I remember from the, the Killer Gorilla JC that was smoking shit that we was like should battle Lux. I don't know where everything went in between, but where you was at in that party right there? Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. We want to see you versus some 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 killers. Now I got you winning the battle clear one though. Your round was like ten minutes long. His was like six. You know what I'm saying? I watched it twice. So when I watch it the second time around, I start picking up on how long the round is, uh, whether the person slipped. Uh, how they look, was they comfortable, you know what I'm saying, uh, who's, who, who's was received by the crowd better. I got different ways to view a battle. When I watch it the first time, I just watch it. I may pick up a winner when I do, but if not, I'm, I know I'm going to come back to it again. And the second time around is when I really gauged it. Um, Death the Kid's nice, though. You know what I'm saying? I like what you're able to do. Dope bars and shit like that. Uh, that's why I was glad to recap it. I talked about you when you was on Max Out, too, you know what I'm saying? I talk about, it's funny as hell, you know what I'm saying, that I talk about you and I really want to see you go places and do things. Your man's going to be doing some corny shit sometimes, I'm not going to lie. They will have a whole radio show and talk about me for an hour or two, but they won't even break down your battle. Why? They won't. <laughs> really what we talking about, this is whole shit, man. <laughs> Niggas will talk about me in lie, like lies, full lies, you know what I'm saying? But they won't, they haven't even broken down your battle. If they do, break it down. Thanks, because I'm saying it now. So a nigga go do it because I said do it. But you know what I'm saying? I still don't feel no way. But but what I will tell you about media, post by <laughs> I'm like compromised media, only post by shit. With the, I be telling um the artists, like when you associate with yourself with people, you gotta make sure that you know everything's on the up and up. Cause if they talk about me for a whole hour with no truth, I could literally be like, yo, fuck this nigga. I ain't recapping this battle. Two, three people told me about it. But I still did it because you deserve the shine. The fuck shit that they do don't have nothing to do with you. But I could easily be like, I ain't recapping it. You know what I'm saying? Niggas remember I talking about I got surf locked up and all this other crazy shit that never happened. And like, nigga, what made you the nigga to jump out the window and just get the... <laughs> I'm so flabbergasted, bro. <laughs> I, am I am flabbergasted, bro. I'm flabbergasted, bro. Oh, God. I'm so confused, bro. These niggas got me fucked up. And then when it's dispelled, they just go on about their day, but they put lies on me, saying, oh, he snitched on this nigga, knowing that I be, I got to be in the street, I be in New York, I be in the Bronx, so you putting the, the, them type of lies on me. But good thing niggas that really know, no, like, yo, them niggas be lying anyway. You know what I'm saying? These niggas robbed from Pat State. Who would believe these niggas? So not, that's the good thing about it. But as an artist, these are the people you associate yourself with, people that do fuck shit like this. And if they don't, if niggas don't rock with you because of it, I could easily not recap your battle. You know what I'm saying? I could easily just go on by my day. But I'm going to do it anyway because I think you deserve the shine and you deserve the advice. And you did good versus the JC. Did you win? No, you ain't win. Hell no. <laughs> Hell no, you ain't winning. But you did a good job. I would love to see you again. You got to tighten up with the flows and make sure you remember all your bars and remember all your rounds and shit and make sure you end your rounds because the way you end your rounds means a lot. I know you're going to see this. 
I hope your niggas don't feel no type of way. If they do, I really don't give a fuck because they be talking crazy about me and I never talk about these niggas. But they, I promise you, they got at least three, four, five blogs talking about me on their shit. You can put my name in and find it. You can't put their name in on my shit and never find it. And never will, you know what I mean? But um, I just want to let you know that, you know what I'm saying? So shout out to you. Keep doing what you're doing. I hope to see you keep keep moving on with your career and progressing and you know what I'm saying? We'll see you in some bigger planes and platforms. And I really don't be talking about fuck shit with, these, with a lot of these niggas. But I, I couldn't recap your battle without letting you know, you know what I'm saying? The same niggas that was running around calling people behind the scenes and trying to get them to talk about it. Yo, why did it? Yeah, I be hearing about that shit. The same people y'all be calling, be calling me and telling me about it. <laughs> y'all know I'm him, I'm that guy, man. I'm sorry, man, you know what I'm saying? The reason why we happy because we still here, my nigga. You know what I'm saying? Making more profit and the fuck shit niggas do, they can't stop it. Gang, gang!